Boom, Keto Crate. Welcome back to another video, guys. I am absolutely ecstatic to be able to do this review with you. I've been waiting a while to do a review on Keto Crate, and I'm glad I finally got my box in. I've actually had this box for a little bit, I'd say about a week, maybe two weeks. Um, but in this video, I'm just going to go through this as quick as possible, show you guys what's in it, and by the end, I'll let you know my thoughts and my personal opinions on Keto Crate. And then I will also give you guys a discount code if you want to pick up your very own Keto Crate. But for those of you that don't know anything about Keto Crate, Keto Crate is designed for people that are on the ketogenic diet and they have different snacks, they have a lot of different types of food in there that can help you try out new things and yeah, we'll get a little bit more into it. So if you guys are ready, let's go ahead and get this video started. All right, let's go ahead and get this review underway and get this box opened up. Now I do wanna let you guys know that I actually bought two of these boxes. Um, the first one I got because I wanted to kind of try out everything in the box. I didn't eat everything quite yet, but I'll give you my honest opinion on everything in the box. This company does not pay me to give this review, so these are my honest opinions for you guys. And I wouldn't promote anything on my channel unless it was absolutely perfect and I loved it. So um, opening the box here, looks like they have a couple of different things on here, kind of giving you a little bit of insight on what Keto Crate is. And then they also have a little guide here. This guide is going to go through everything and tell you exactly how much it is per product as well as where you can get it. And then the cool thing is that I really enjoy is they give you a discount code on the specific products on their website using a specific code that uh, Keto Crate got from that company. So that's really neat. That's one thing I really love about this. Um, so getting in here, first thing on the list is Hilton's um, potato pork rinds. Um, they're Hosier style Chirones. So these are these are absolutely disgusting. <laughs> I will be 100% honest. I do not like these at all. Um, the smell of them is really good and they kind of look amazing, but they're very hard and you like break a tooth on it. And I read a couple other reviews from a couple other people and they didn't like it either. So I don't see Keto Crate putting this in there any anymore. So I'm gonna go ahead and just put that aside. Um, next on the list is Ella's Flats. So these are hemp flats. They're one gram of net car uh, net carbs, so they're obviously keto friendly. Um, it's scrumptious for breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks. You can put you know eggs on it, avocado, meat, whatever you like. There's no preservatives. Uh, Ten grams of fat. Uh, only one gram of net carbs and eight grams of protein in each piece, which is uh, about serving size is two flats. So that's pretty good. Um, these are three twenty-five, so in my opinion, a little pricey. I'd rather try to make something at home. Um, but Ellis Flats, pretty neat. Um, next on the list, we got the free range chicken. So this is a free range chicken pepper style bar. So it's actually like a little jerky bar made out of chicken, but cage free and all that, obviously, um, with the uh, keto. So it's pretty cool. It only has 1.5 grams of fat, one gram of carb, and protein is 13 grams. I've actually had this and I thought it was perfect. I love jerky, all types and all kinds. Um, since this is chicken jerky, it, it was pretty good. Um, had a really good flavor profile to it, so I would highly suggest to do this. This is actually $2.99 for a bar. A um, little pricey, but anything that you get that's gluten-free, that's on the keto diet, typically has a higher priced product, but it's worth it if you're trying to stay consistent on your diet, so I highly recommend that. All right, and then we have the protein bar, Raw Rev Glow. It's a protein bar that's peanut butter and sea salt. Another amazing product. 11 grams of protein, 13 grams of fiber, only 2 grams of sugar, um, gluten-free. This is a really good option as well. Only $1.89, so this is a really good one as well. I'll probably actually look this company up and get more of these because I'm always used to doing the Quest Bar, and those are amazing, but this one is a lot better, knocks it out of the ballpark, so I highly suggest those. Um, Got to go with a little bit of a Sweets Energy Pod Chocolate Fudge. I have not tried this yet. The first one we got actually had a broken seal on it, so I contacted the company, and that's how I ended up with a second Keto Crate, is they sent me a whole new one because it was all over the box. So, you know, shout out to Keto Crate for being amazing with your customer service. I was absolutely impeccable, and I appreciate that, uh, getting me another box just for having a small defect like that. Um, but I'm very excited to try this. I would, I, would, I would have to imagine it's really good chocolate. 25 grams of fat. Um, 14 grams of carbs, so it has four grams of fiber, so it's a little bit higher in the carb side, but if you're looking for a late night snack and you're having a high carb day, then why not? It's only seven grams of protein, so. That little tiny cup, it's actually $3.99, so a little overpriced for my liking, but you know, for chocolate, sometimes it's worth it. Um, next one is the Cave Fat Pack, Keto, Paleo, and Vegan Approved. So this is pretty much, uh, looks like it's just, let's see what, I don't even know what this is. 
All right, so they say you can eat it like candy. Um, you can put it in your coffee, sprinkle it on anything, fatten your shakes, um, pretty much do anything with it. So it's just like a substance that you put in with something else or you can just eat it straight out of the package. Um, I have not tried this as well, so I would be kind of interested in the flavor profile of this, but it's $5.99 for the entire thing. There's four servings in it, so that's really not that bad. Um, five, or that's looks like nine grams of fat, three grams of carbs, and one gram of protein. So that's pretty cool. Uh, and then we also have, looks like, piquet. I think that's how you say it, piquet. I'm not sure, piquet. <laughs> it's a, basically improves gut health, reduces stress, sustains energy. Looks like a tea crystal. So it's another like little tea, something you can mix up, a little different taste profile. If you guys do intermittent fasting like me, this looks like this would be a good option for you. So I'm excited to try that. Um, that looks like it is, oh, there it is. Okay, okay, that's only 75 cents for the tea crystals, so that's pretty good price point in my opinion. Um, I spent about 79 cents on uh, the Powerade. Uh, that's about 79 cents usually on discount, so it's an alternative. I like to try different things. Um, we also have Mocha Individual Pack Grass-Fed Butter. Burn and Butter is the company with MCT and avocado oil. So this is perfect. I can't tell you how much amazing this is. So it's a mocha flavored. So I'd be pretty interested to try this inside my coffee to see if it gives you that extra flavor profile. But what it all has, it has avocado oil, MCT oils, clarified butter, unsweetened chocolate, and monk fruit extract. So this is 100% good for you. Um, it has 25 grams of fat, two grams of carbs, and one gram of protein. So if you want to get your fats in early and you know you're going to be busy throughout the day, this would probably be perfect inside of a black coffee in the morning. So I can't wait to try that as well. Um, then we have Collagen nut butter, salted caramel. So I'm guessing this is probably a lot like the fat bomb if you've watched a previous video of mine. I did a review on fat bombs. This is probably very similar to that. 13 grams of protein, one gram of net carbs, zero grams of sugar, um, and 10 grams of fat. So that's pretty good. It's just like a different sea salted caramel. Get a high fat in for the day. You're looking for a little bit extra in the morning. Uh, olives. Olives always come in these packages I hear. So olives are a very high source of good fats. Um, as well as low in carbs and low in protein. So if you're looking at getting something extra inside of your meal, this is something you can eat right out of the package. It doesn't need to be refrigerated unless it's opened. Um, I think there's like 14 um, olives in this one. Um, so that's not too bad either. Next, lemon teriyaki pumpkin seeds. So we love pumpkin seeds, especially my wife. She she loves to eat pumpkin seeds, but to have flavored kind is a whole nother ball game. And to have them at a good macro level it is good too. So if you like pumpkin seeds, that's a good alternative for you. It's only $3.99, which is not bad in my opinion for uh, pumpkin seeds, especially since the lemon teriyaki. So flavor profile is probably there. Um, she actually said she tasted those and she loved them. So, but cool. Now, last thing that's here is their item. So they always have one item that's kind of their highlighted item. Um, and then the cool part about it is that on this sheet here, they actually put a recipe for you. So a recipe to try out with this. I have not tried this before, but it's coconut curry pasta um, is the recipe, but it's palmini. Palmini. One of the two. I don't know. All right, one of the two it's called that, but it's gluten-free pasta. It's linguine, actually. Um, has zero grams of fat, only two grams of net carbs, and two grams of protein. So if you guys are on the ketogenic diet, you know exactly what it's like to not have any carbs or things like carbs. So this is a great alternative. I'm pretty excited to try this and see if it actually hits that flavor profile just like regular linguine. Um, but the coconut curry pasta is only 16 grams of fat, six grams of net carbs. So that's going to be a pretty cool thing to try out. Maybe I'll make a video for you guys if you would like to see that. Go ahead and leave a comment below and let me know or just simply smash the like button and I'll be able to make a video around that for you guys. But that's everything. So it gives you a lot of different types of um, options as far as snacks on the keto diet. And when you're on the keto diet, it's all about trying new things and finding different ways to incorporate new food into your diet just to make it that much easier for you. So this is awesome. There is some stuff in here I didn't like and there's some stuff that I absolutely did love. Um, so would I buy this again? Probably because I'm a type of person that doesn't like to base everything just on one month. So I'll probably do another review on next month's Keto Crate. Um, but as of right now, the company is amazing. They gave me uh, you know, another free box just because I had an issue with one of the things breaking out in the box and they wanted to make sure I was completely happy. So for my opinion, I'm going to go ahead and give them another shot and see how they are. And I'll give you guys an even more in-depth review later on in another video. But for now, I think this is a good option. And there's tons of different companies out there that do things like this. So if you guys know of another company that you really like and you'd like to see a review on, let me know as well and I'll be more than happy to do that for you. Um, but as of right now, I do 
have a discount code and I'll put that on the screen right now down below here. If you guys want to try out the Keto Crate, I'll give you $5 off your first purchase. So it's $29.95 um, for the actual box to be shipped to your house. So um, that's pretty cool. I like that option. And like I said, again, guys, you know, I, I can't give my entire full review on this just because I've only tried one month. So moving forward, I'll give more reviews on the uh, later months and let you know exactly what I think. But for now, I think this is a viable option for being able to try different snacks out. Um, so that's important on the diet. All right, so let's go ahead and wrap up this video. I hope this video wasn't too long for you guys. I like to make these as quick as possible because I know what it's like to go through so many different options and it can get kind of boring. So I want to make it go as quick as possible for you. But there's a lot of good stuff inside the Keto Crate. I give it a two thumbs up as of right now and I'll keep you guys updated on my opinion on it. But if you like that discount code, go ahead and look at it in the description. Um, if you guys like these type of videos though, go ahead and smash the like button. If you have not done so already, subscribe to my channel down below Below. It'd be awesome. It allows this video to reach that many more people and impact so many more people's lives. We're here to change people's lives and just make it all around easier to follow your diet. So once again, thank you guys so much for listening. I greatly appreciate it. Continue to stay positive. Continue to stay consistent on your diet. And if you guys need any help with your meal plans or coaching and learning how to get on the diet, how to find your macros, let me know. Email me below. My email is in the description and I would love to help you guys. It's at no cost to you, 100%. I just want to help you guys out. So thanks again for watching my video and I look forward to seeing you guys at the very next video.